familiar with that backup sound, that means you have a one of the new Ford hybrids or the all-electric Mach-E. Uh, this here is the uh, Platinum Power Boost uh, F-150. It's a hybrid. Um, and not, not everybody that has a hybrid or electric car wants to sound like a, a dump truck when you're backing into your driveway or backing into a parking spot. And, um, you know, maybe your, maybe your job has you coming home late, 2 in the morning or something, and you don't want to wake your family up when you, you know, back into your garage. It's just really loud. It's a lot louder than it needed to be. Uh, my neighbors can hear me when I come home. Or maybe you want to pull quietly into your favorite hunting spot and you don't want the animals uh, to know that you're there. That's where this device comes in. This was made by Mega Ohm Motorsports. I'll put the link down in the description below. Uh, this is a speaker bypass kit. And there's a speaker under your front bumper that emits that backup noise and also creates a fake electric engine noise it's like a high pitched whining noise it's really not quiet installing this device will make your electric vehicle quiet and it'll get rid of that annoying backup tone so simply disconnecting the speaker isn't good enough it'll project a lot of error messages and stuff on your cluster and this device fixes that I will say as a disclaimer this is an off-road uh, use only part it's not officially f uh, made by Ford it's really easy to install only takes a 15 millimeter socket and about 10 minutes so that being said I'll go ahead and show you uh, the before and after videos that I took you can hear the difference um, and then at the very end I will show you how to install this part All right, so I hope this showed you how much of a difference uh, this device makes. You could really hear the difference of how, how much quieter your vehicle should be. And this device is just phenomenal. So um, check out the website in the description below. And give me a thumbs up. And please subscribe to my channel if you found this video helpful. If you want to see how to install this, well, here we go. Alright, so we are right under the front bumper. And you can see this device right here is your speaker. Yep, see that black thing with the white label? That is your speaker. And that's the plug right there that you have to disconnect and just plug this device in. To get to it, you may be able to get to it if you have tiny little hands. Um, but you see right up in there is the connector. So you'll need to remove this is your radiator, lower radiator support. It is 15 millimeter. There's a uh, socket bolt here and down the other end. And then you'll be able to move this out of the way so you can um, get to it. All right, with just those two bolts, with that one removed and the other one loosened, I was able to reach up on top and squeeze the little tab that disconnected that from the speaker. So now I'm going to take this and plug it in. I'm going to take this blue cap that's here and plug it into the speaker hole where the, the wire's connected in the speaker, just to keep it clean um, for the future. All right, so you can see that I have the weather cap, the blue weather cap, plugged into where the speaker 
uh, into the speaker connection. And now I have this gadget installed. And then it came with a tie wrap. So then we're going to tie wrap it right up here to keep it out of the way. And then we're gonna tighten back our radiator support. All right, so there we have the device in place and we've tightened down the radiator support again make sure you get it really tight also if you're using a short wrench like i was word to the wise this can be a knuckle buster when you're turning so be very gentle or pull over on this side where you have a little bit more room so now we'll go inside the car we shouldn't have any error lights at all Getting into the truck for the first time after doing the mod. I'm gonna open it up. And if it works like it should, we should not have any error lights at all on the dash. So let's see here. Alright, so there you go guys. You've seen the before and after you listen to the difference it makes. Um, really easy to install, so if this is something you're interested in, go check out the link in the description below and get you one of these. If you thought this video was helpful, please subscribe guys. Thanks for watching. Um, see you soon.